Today this spot is a paid attraction and at the time of this video it was fenced off last year. Tickets to enter the area can be bought at the Baston War Museum and once you enter the area you can find several voxels. A newly added tour can be followed by phone if the Wi-Fi signal holds up. Keep in mind that if you just walk into the woods outside of the fenced off area you will find several other holes all there to be viewed free of charge. And I say fake because in 2007 reenactors came here and dug most of these holes during a reenactment. Most of these holes are still being maintained and represented as real today. So I started looking through several videos and noticed that in one video one voxel that was there in 2009 seems to be gone in 2011. And when you compare the area to a video taken in 2023, it's an entirely different area. And the voxel in particular is just a shallow hole now. Also have a look at the changes made to the space in the foreground of the video, around the third voxel. When one tree was removed, they created a giant voxel and they seem to have removed the hole that was in front of the tree before. You can find several of these examples and videos all over YouTube, because in almost all these videos the forest looks different every time. But 